So if you've got a Chromebook and you're experiencing an issue like uh, it is stuck when you open your Chromebook and it is stuck there where it's written Chrome and it won't continue to go further. So I'm going to show you how you can actually fix this problem. First of all, um, what you need to do is to press the escape, the refresh button, and the power button. When you've pressed that, it will go to the screen right here, where at the bottom it will show you uh, the model, the model of your Chrome. So the model of the Chrome differs from Chrome to Chrome. So what you need to do is to save uh, the model name you're going to use it uh, on another part of this video that i'm going to show you now what is left for you to do is uh, search for chrome book recovery utility chrome book recovery utility And then where it's written Chromebook Recovery Utility on Google Search, make sure you click that one. Make sure also that you are using uh, Google Chrome when you are searching for this app on your PC. Make sure that you are using Google Chrome. <coughs> Here it will, let me show you, because it, I've already installed it, it says I must remove it. But on your side, because you haven't installed this Chromebook recovery utility, it's going to say add to Chrome. Make sure that you have signed in so that it can be added to Chrome. And then it will say add extension. And then when you see this black uh, screen right there it will say Chromebook recovery utility has been added to Chrome what you're going to do is going to you're going to go to your extensions it's something that it's an icon there at the top of your Google Chrome that's like a pie at the top right corner that you have to click then when you click you're going to see your extension called Chromebook Recovery Utility, you're going to click it. And when you click it, it's going to give you a screen that is going to prepare you to install the operating system. So the operating system, just make sure that you have a, a, a USB flash drive uh, already inserted on your PC. Make sure that it's uh, 8 gig or larger it says you'll need an 8 gig uh, USB flash drive or larger than that so mine uh, let me check mine uh, mine I have a 14 gigabytes so I am safe so we're going to go back and say and click on get started and then here we're going to add the model of the Chromebook. So I'm going to go back to my Chromebook to remember the model. Okay, I've already uh, typed the model. So it will say found a match when you've inserted the correct model and then you're going to click continue. Then you're going to select your USB fresh drive. Yes, and then you're going to click continue. Then you're going to click on create new. Then it's going to start creating your recovery image. Make sure that you have an internet connection when you are doing all of this. Yes, make sure that your internet connection is good. Then it's going to start downloading your recovery image. 
I will pause the video because it's going to take about 15 to 30 minutes. Now it has been, now it is finished. And then when it's done, it will say success, success, your recovery is ready. So now you can remove uh, the USB. I have inserted my USB drive on the Chromebook. I'm going to open it. Turn it on. Now what you have to do here is to press the escape refresh and the power button it's going to take you to this place and it's going to automatically uh, put you on the installation process so what's basically going to happen is that your chromebook is going to install the image that you've successfully installed on your USB flash drive. It's going to take some time. So I'm going to pause the video to show you when it's done. So now it says system recovery is complete. Please remove the media on your computer and your computer will restart automatically. So I'm removing the media and it's restarting hopefully that has been fixed let's wait and see what's going to happen and it proceeds as you can see guys it's proceeding uh, we have successfully fixed the problem of Chromebook. So it's asking me to connect to the Wi-Fi. So in this part, once you've connected to the network, it's going to ask you to sign in to your Chromebook. So in this case, I'm not going to sign in because I'm, I'm actually fixing a Chromebook for a client. So I'm going to browse as a guest. I'm going to browse Chromebook as a guest just to check and make sure that it's working. So there we go. It's actually working. It says I'm browsing as a guest. So the issue has been resolved. So the Chromebook is now working. It's no longer stuck at the beginning. So what happens is all your files will be deleted, right? So before you actually do this step, just make sure that uh, you've got a recovery for your files. Because once you've done this step, it's going to delete all your files. It's going to delete all your files, but it will uh, leave your Chromebook working. Now the Chromebook is working, the client will be happy. Thank you.